everyone and welcome to Celebrity Ready Steady Cook. Now I'm really really excited about tonight's show and when you find out who our celebrity shoppers are I guarantee you'll be excited too. But before we meet them let's welcome our culinary kings. They are James Martin <laughs> and Brian Turner. Hey there Hello sir. Hi. Hi. I'm damn fine to see you. How you doing? Hi, mate. Very, very good. Now, what type of music are you into these days, then, Brian? Um, really popular brass band stuff. Yeah? You like a bit of your... Bum, bum, I bum, love bum, all bum, that, bum, yeah. Bum. And yeah. what about old young Jamie over here? Different style, perhaps? Headbanging. Just a bit, I think. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just a bit. Well, our first guest tonight has produced over 100 hit singles. He's been awarded an MBE for his services to show business and a knighthood for his services to charity. He found music when he was a young boy, and he's wired for sound ever since, ladies and gentlemen. I tell you, oh, yes. Please give a very warm welcome to the one and only Sir Cliff Richards! <laughs> Looking good, isn't he? Should eh? I go home now? Yeah, yeah, no, no. <laughs> no, you don't need to go. I've got to say, you've already got something cooked. <laughs> <laughs> now you've uh, you've got all these kind of awards and different kind of things for like MBEs and stuff like that and knighthoods. But any awards for cooking? No, I've got to say. I've got to warn you now that I don't have any awards for cooking. Nothing at all. No, I do a good you fried just egg. Sit there and smile. We'll be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's have a look at your goodies then. Okay. Now, that's it. See if you can inspire Brian to cooking something wonderful. Here we are. There oh. it is. Oh, wow. Look at this. Have a little chat with us about this. Let's get rid of your bag for you. Okay. Oh, mm. <laughs> <laughs> Spinach, red mm -hmm. onion, sweet potatoes, lamb, and dolce latte cheese. Mmm, a bit of the old Italian influence creeping in there. I tended to th pick things I liked. Well, yeah. it's a good idea. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, someone's going to be happy tonight, even if it's just you. I, I didn't think whether they'd go together or anything. Well, you'll you make sure that. they go together. <laughs> now, how much was this little lot, then? How much should you but, Well, how much were we allowed to spend? Well, you're allowed to spend up to five pounds. Do you know what? It was exactly fiver. <laughs> He's smooth, isn't he? He's so smooth. But it's interesting that the lamb actually cost four pound ninety-two. No, no, no. <laughs> two, two pounds forty. It's organic. Ah. It, 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 I don't know why they make it all so expensive. They're real quality stuff. What so do you the think rest of, that, of it's going to split. Do you, do you like that little uh, selection we got there? Yeah, it's it's interesting. <laughs> No, it's we'll be great. Oh, will it? You'll see. be fantastic. <laughs> I'm sure you will. <laughs> I'm gonna you watch. have a bit of a thing. We're about to meet our next guest there. Now, ladies and gentlemen, life wasn't always plain sailing for our next guest, but she's cruised her way into our hearts a few years ago and has been entertaining us with her music and her gritty sense of humour ever since. Will you please give a warm welcome to our very own star for tonight, the lovely Jane McDonald! <laughs> Yeah, come on Great to see hey, you. Hey, this is James. Hello. Oh, oh yeah. hello. Oh. <laughs> hello, Jay. Oh, I think there's something happening there already, isn't oh, there? Oh, the temperature's you, you'll make rising. Henry, your husband, a bit jealous. We'll oh, have to watch out for he's that. in the back. He won't know. He won't know, will he? <laughs> How are you doing? I'm very well, you thank good? you. And what about sort of cooking for you? Are you you're quite active in the kitchen, or just like, oh, Henry, you get on with it? I'm absolutely rubbish. No, you. <laughs> <laughs> He, he didn't marry me for my cooking skills. He didn't? No. Oh, well, no. let's have a look at your bag. Perhaps oh. James will do something right. inspirational for you. Oh, my onions are creeping Squid. away oh. there. Oh, that's... Oh, talk yeah. to us about this then, James. Well, calamari. Mm -hmm. Reminds me of my holidays. Yeah. You know, deep fried calamari. I always like a bit of that. Yeah. I've got rice, cos it's there. Mm. You know, a bit of sweet corn. A bit of sweet corn. It's mm. all done for you. None of this cob stuff. Yeah. Then we've got <laughs> sugar... Sugar snap peas. Yeah. Sugar snaps because it's funny, I'm, I'm not very keen on just peas. Mm -hmm. 
But put them in the pods and they're lovely. Ah. You know, <laughs> Mon's too, not quite there. No, you like that. You like a like, like snappy taste. I like a bit of a, like a, of a crunch. snap, I do. Yeah. I Ooh. do. A bit of a crunchy, so Ooh. sugar snap please. Bit of carrot for mm -hmm. colour. Thought, and know. the old onion. Can't That's really beat good, it. Isn't it? Can't yeah. always have onions because it always, you know. Yeah. Works How much treat. did you spend on that lot then? You're exactly obviously... four pounds ninety-four. Right, James. You and uh, Jane have a bit of a think, and I'll come back and see in a moment. Okay. He'll do something delicious. I guarantee it. Mm. Brian, what are you going to do for Sir Cliff? Well, what I thought we'd do: we make uh, three little courses. We'll take this lamb's quite big. We'll take this heart, uh, this lump here. We'll do a kofta with this. Mm -hmm. Grill this bit here. Make mashed uh, sweet potato. Spinach salad with Dolce Latte on toast. Ooh. That's in, the, in a nutmeg. Not work. Not work. Simple. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that impress your Mediterranean taste buds? Yeah. It does, actually, because I've always seen that. I liked. The only thing you didn't mention was the onions. Yeah. Yeah. We'll use that to flavour everything. Oh, okay. <laughs> <Fine. laughs> <laughs> like yeah. And is it Sir Cliff or Cliff? What do you prefer? Uh, just Cliff, but Bow. Bow. All right. <laughs> What's he like, Jane? I don't know I do. We love him. Oh, we love him. Of course we do. Make him curtsy, Jane. <laughs> <laughs> Make him curtsy. All right. <laughs> what are you going to do over this side, then, um, Jane? What are we going to do? Well, first of all, you're going to prep this. Yeah. Oh. Squid. Me? Yeah. yeah. Um, and then I think we'll do sort of an Indian and sort of Chinesey sort of two different dishes. Um, so we'll maybe do one like a tomato sort of a kushundi, maybe a sort of chutney, yeah. a tomato puree. Reduce down loads of spices in and do that with nice rice. And then deep fry one of these in calamari. Oh, I know yeah. you like that. And then we'll marinate the other one. And I think we'll do sort of like an oriental salad using these, but then blanched. With I think there's loads of people at home who want to know how to do that calamari, don't they? Yeah. That nice and crispy, crunchy. Nice. Oh, we, we like can't that. wait, can we? Well, they've got 20 minutes. When I say these words, ready, steady, cook. Go, boss. Off you go. That's it. You right, that's it. Sorry about that. Get the board up first. Yeah. Do you want to put an apron on? Uh, oh, yeah, oh, good it. idea, good thinking. Oh, yeah, there I'll you work. go. All right, then. Is Jane all right down there? You all right, Jane? I don't want to get blood Lovely. everywhere. That's it. No, Fantastic. don't get any blood. I can't stand no, the sight okay. of blood, huh? Well, it wouldn't show on my jacket, of course. <laughs> so wipe your fingers mm. on your jacket. <laughs> <laughs> right, fine. I've spit no, that. you talked about this, Brian. You said you're going to separate it. What's, what's the idea of sort of buying a chump steak and sort of cutting it up <laughs> like that? Well, because I want to impress all those people and Cliff out here. So really? we'll just, we'll bash this one out. Yeah. I know that Cliff's not got a large appetite, so suddenly that piece of meat is big enough. So we'll have a tasty starter and get a couple of dishes out of it. So we need some garlic, mm -hmm. some chilli, and we need to get the kofta on the go first. OK, one so minute gone already, that. boys. So we'll chop that up. Mm. We don't want too much. It's just a starter, yeah. and it's just a single portion. Mm -hmm. So it's not as if we need a lot. Put and, of course, you're there. talking about the spices, the influence of all the different spices that we associate Absolutely. with. A bit of chilli there, make it yeah. nice and hot. Did I bring the garlic? Mm -hmm. ah. Lovely. OK, nice and fine. Now, I don't yeah. normally like to put meat into these because it grinds it up. Yeah. But for this, you want to grind it and get almost a paste. Beautiful. And right. it won't take long to cook. I'm going to put on a kebab stick. I'm going to put some kebab sticks into water. OK, you're going to bind that round. Yeah. OK, and you've got to get busy right. there. I'm all right. Sweet potato, peeling onions. onions. I'll Do come want, back and see the onion please. be chopped. No. All right, how's it going, Jane? Fine. Jane's mm -hmm. segment in an orange. Yeah. yeah. We'll prep this squid now. OK. Yeah. You want Ready? me over there? Yeah. Oh, I can't get enough hands. There right, we are. now what we do is literally you insert the carrot that I've wrapped in cling film up in the squid, all right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I'm sure you've had practice at this. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, stop it! Stop it! Squid. <laughs> I like. Yeah. Oh my God! And what's the idea of that, then, Jane? <laughs> oh, it's fat at me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> don't look, don't look. Jane, here. <laughs> oh, now, dear. hold it. So you need to be quite firm with it. You need to be quite firm with right, it. Right, I'm firm. Right, right, in there. I don't, but don't watch, mother. Don't watch. Uh, no, it's... it's oh, very good. Fair. Very good. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. Look, you've done a round of applause. Woo! Look at that. Beautiful. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> very nice yeah. indeed. OK. And what exactly are you going to do with that, James? <laughs> Sorry? What exactly are you going to do with that? Nothing. We just thought it looked good. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, we're just... Four minutes gone, gentlemen. We're just cleaning Four. out the inside like that. And yeah. then what you need to do to put it back again, you need to do it the other way around. Yeah. I have to right. do that again? Yeah, but do it so it's actually inside out again. 
right? right. So you literally you turn it inside out in order to clean it and remove yeah. all, all that kind of clean final it, make sure membrane. Clean it completely clean. There. Yeah. There you go. And do the same with the other one. Okay. okay. Right. Wonderful. Suspended. I've got the hang of this got now. Mm. <laughs> now. What else have we got on here, James? We've got some Indian spices that I'm toasting off. Yeah. Which are a combination of these here. All those in front of you there, and okay. I'm going to blend those to a paste. We're going to blend that to a paste. Okay. Beautiful. <laughs> No, I've got holes. I've gone a bit strange, actually. <laughs> oh, don't worry. It will taste fantastic. Don't worry. There we are. Now, now, and what else have we got? We've got the got rice cooking. The rice here is cooking away nicely, which yeah. is fine. And, and then, uh, and that's it, really. We're just going to actually marinate our squid now in this sort of Indian spice mix. Fine. Yeah. And there a balsamic go. reduction. Yeah. OK, well, okay. I'll, I'll, I'll leave you to get on with it. Thank I'm just going to catch much. up with Brian with these, uh, see how he's getting on. Okay. Man, yeah. out the way. I don't want to cut anybody here. No, no, no. I'll, I'll, I'll move to this side. There's no problem. Where does the parsley go? Right. Uh, it's coriander, and we mm -hmm. want that in here, chef. Mm. So it is. Oh, right. Ta, thank you much, good man. That's great. Okay, so we got that on the go That's there. Quite, now, what we need? Quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. You say? Do you want to chop half that onion finely? Can you do that? Yeah, I think I can. Good man. As soon as you can, let's get in here for some sauce. Okay. okay. No, right, so we've got this one in marinade now, OK, this, this Angeli? Yeah, carry on. Are you on. doing that or not? No, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just going to show Cliff a quick way of doing it. Oh, what a we nice take man, it down yeah. here first, like Ooh. that, yeah. yeah. That's it. 14 minutes to go, gentlemen. And then we go the other way, and then you automatically you'll have those lovely pieces of shredded onion. Now, I'll start that one off here too. Here we are. Now, Cliff, I've got to say to you, I mean, what's it, six decades of... Uh, of music, yeah, well, of making music. Have you, have you got a yeah, favourite one? Not 60 years of music. It was just how I happened to get the <laughs> tail end of the 50s. Yeah. <laughs> now, how do you feel, eh? <laughs> oh. Oh, I got the tail end of the 50s, and yeah. I was lucky enough to have hits in all the others, mm -hmm. other decades, and so therefore it's six decades of, for instance, number ones. I've actually mm. had a number one in each of the six decades. I know, 14 number ones, it's incredible. Do you have a favourite amongst any of those? Uh, the 15th one. Yeah, the last one, of course. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Because, I mean, it was against all the odds that Millennium Prayer finally made it. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I know, yeah, it was, yeah. Uh, absolutely. A lot of the DJs didn't play it, did they? And it still came through. It just proved there's people out there, the music's well, good enough, they're going to buy it. I think sometimes the public, if they get to hear mm -hmm. a song, and they like it, they've got to like it, they yeah, tend to want yeah. to buy it. But it was just one of those things. I mean, things have changed, and I've got to learn to change right, right. with it, I right. guess. Yeah. What you need to do now, just whilst you're talking, just big knife and put your hand over the top and chop it so oh. we don't get any big lumps in there. Get, oh, okay. rid of, get those little lumps, all right? OK. Lovely. Oh, good, man. Beautiful. OK, God, that feels really so professional. I know. That looks very stylish there. Now, what about this, uh, you know, going back to when you first, uh, first everything started for you, yeah. people criticised you a little bit because you had that kind of hip movement, didn't they? People, oh. A lot of parents were against that. I've still got it. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> but it changed, though, didn't it? I mean, oh, yeah, well, it had to change. I mean, everything changes, but it's really strange when you think that my first reviews mm -hmm. said that I was... Uh, you know, it was crude exhibitionism. I mean, yeah. it's ridiculous. The British Elvis. Yeah, I mean, I guess I, I would like to have been Elvis, but very early on I realised mm. that I couldn't be. No, not I could. Now. No, not certainly you not now. You wouldn't be Elvis now, would you? No, yeah. <laughs> Less than 12 tomorrow, minutes. Would you, eh? <laughs> <laughs> really? What type of music do you listen to when you're cooking at home, then? Or do you sing when you're cooking? Uh, do you listen to the no, arches? I, I do. I listen to the arches on a Sunday. Yeah, yeah do, do you listen to the But, um, no, generally speaking, I play a variety of stuff. I mean, just mm -hmm. recently I've been playing... I've dug up a Bonnie Rayet record. Do you, do you know Bonnie Rayet? Oh, yeah. She's a wonderful blues singer. Probably the greatest um, slide guitarist in the world. Mm -hmm. And I've been playing her. I still like to play Michael Jackson. Yeah. But he's I mean, that's classic, really good. Just Mariah, wonderful I stuff. I love Mariah Carey as well. Mm -hmm. I mean, she's very gymnastic with her vocals and something I could mm. never do, but she... Any, any just... boy bands or girl bands out there that you kind of think, hey, they've got it, they, they know what the secret is? I like some of the stuff All Saints have done. Yeah. And uh, I thought Boys Own could really sing. Mm. You know, quite often you hear stories about some of the bands that don't actually sing on their records, etc. Mm. but I'm convinced that Boys Own do. Now, you're known as the Peter Pan of pop. Say that again. The Peter Pan of pop. Now have a drink and say it. <laughs> <laughs> do you take alcohol? I do, yeah. Fine. <laughs> oh, look. Yeah, well, we we'll make a red wine sauce. keep yourself you. looking so good? We're all out there, we're all thinking this about... man, you know. Oh, sorry, I thought you were talking to oh, me. Oh, get out of there, Brian. <laughs> Well, I think it's a matter of, I think you do have to watch your diet. Yeah. I try to eat one meal a day. This last year, I had a year off, and everything's gone to pot. Mm. And uh, I will diet down in time for my next lot of concerts. But yeah. uh, if you eat 
reasonably and get some ex exercise, mm -hmm. it's not difficult to actually keep your shape. But you do like 15 minutes of exercise before you have breakfast, though, don't you? Most people no, are sort I of don't... shoving the coffee in and running out the door. No, I, no, I don't do 15 minutes. Mm. I, I never get out of bed without stretching, which is a different whole matter of yeah. getting your spine stretched out. But uh, really, the only exercise I've ever done uh, is play tennis. Mm. And uh, every now and then, I have a phase of going to the gym and trying to work out, but yeah. it's, it's really hard to keep that up. You need to do that regularly, three, maybe four yeah. times a week. And then the kind of life we have. Oh. It's not always possible to get up at that. Well, early. I've had you on the tennis court before, haven't I? I know, yeah, I know. We've, we've, played, we've played my tennis tournament twice. Yeah. And he won it once. Yeah. Oh, all right, don't rub it in, don't rub it in. OK, now, Brian, you've got the spinach going with the onion there and the... Is and it the turmeric, that's right, yeah. Turmeric, yeah. They're beautiful smells, aren't oh. they? Wonderful. Well, you can take aroma. that off, that's ready. We've got the spinach here to go into the mashed sweet potatoes over yeah. here. Can you get some grain mustard from over there, please? Green? The uh, grain, grain mustard. mustard, it's the accent. Yeah. Oh, no, it Shall right. I sing it? Will that help? <laughs> Did you sing it? Did you just... Let them get on with it. Less than about nine minutes, What's gentlemen. Nine things? minutes. Fingers. Oh, okay, it. how's it going over here? Is he keeping you busy? Oh, it's wonderful. Oh, yeah. oh. Oh. Nine minutes. <laughs> Right. Bring the roof down. I know he is. He's really going for it. Right, what we've got here? We've got a little tomato reduction there. That's going to go down to sort of like a little chutney. Okay, uh -huh. yeah. Um, we've got one of our little squid pieces that I've just scored and marinated in sort of oh, like these lovely Chinese spice and coriander. Mm -hmm. One of which we made all that nice puree, mm -hmm. and I've done that into a nice sort of batter, mm. sure. to which we're going to deep fat fry that one, and Ooh. do your nice calamari. Lovely, it? Oh, it does, it really does. And do you like food like this, or are you a Yorkshire pudding girl? I'm you know? both. Yeah. I like a bit of everything, me. Yeah. You know. Like, I like to experiment sometimes, yeah. get out there and do different things. Yeah. I like me Yorkshire puds, but I like, you know, calamari. I like all different things. I suppose yeah. it's travelling on the ship so much, you know. Sure. I've, I've had a bit of, you know, mm. different things now and again. Oh, what type of food uh, do, you, do you like at home, though, when you're really just at home? Do you, do you go for something quite plain, or...? No, my mother cooks. Really? <laughs> that's why we live cook? there. Really? She's a fantastic cook, is my mum, and that's... Uh, it works really well, cos, like Cliff, mm. we're on the road all the time, mm. and, yeah. you know, I, I need to keep hold of so this what, husband. what about this famous shepherd's pie story, then? What oh. was that all about? Yeah. Well, my mother taught me that, as well. I, I have made a shepherd's pie for Henry. Uh -huh. And that was it. He asked me to marry him while I was cooking shepherd's pie. Oh. Oh. Did you get to eat it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's a bit That'd sad, really, something. that, isn't it? Oh, yeah, I, did. Know, eventually, I know. Eventually, yeah. eventually. Mm -hmm. mm. Now, we all know that the sort of the cruise, being part of that, that cruise series, mm. completely changed your life. But, and obviously, bought you a little bit of uh, newfound wealth. Yeah, well, so uh, What's yeah. the most extravagant thing that you've ever sort of purchased? I have got a chandelier. I've got a crystal chandelier in my bedroom. Yeah. Yes. I know you all think I'm weird, don't you? <laughs> but I just, yeah, what do you mean? It's not in over there. Seven minutes. <laughs> He's got a mirror above his. Oh. <laughs> I, I know. Anyway. <laughs> I, I, it was a real bargain. Yeah. It was the, the light. The, there was a light shop closing down on our street. So, mm -hmm. and I went in. I got it half price. And Henrik said, "What the heck have you bought here?" Oh, no. I said, "Just put it up and stop, you know, whinging, yeah. like we do, girls, don't we?" Of course, of and, course. Uh, okay, and it looks beautiful mm -hmm. in our bedroom now. You see, so that mm. is very extravagant. Yeah. <laughs> so, other than having the money, what's the best thing about fame? Is it the recognition? Do you think, or no? The it's fans, the money. The fans are great. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> money. Yeah, money. Well, you've got a lot more than I have. But <laughs> I <should> have. <laughs> That's a lot younger than you are. <laughs> Oh, but uh, I've been going as long as Cliff. Six see, minutes so. to go, my lady. So, have we got a, an, another job here? Definitely, oh, definitely. That in, definitely. That, that's beautiful. James, what have we got in here? We've got a nice sort of oriental salad that we've mixed together with coriander, our blanched yeah. uh, carrots, yes. uh, sugar snap peas, a little bit of soy sauce, and some sesame oil, our orange, and the Ooh. honey, and all that sort of stuff Ooh. mixed beautiful. around together. That's going to go with our nice sort of a nice it's spicy it's thing there. Fantastic. Okay, so that's that been displayed beautifully. Oh, yeah. look at that. Look at that. I can't That's wait to get my nice. mouth around that. Oh. <laughs> yeah. oh, I tell you. It's like being on a cruise again, isn't it? Eh? Yeah. I mean, the food is particularly good, isn't it? Lots oh, of people yeah. go on the cruises because they want to eat all that fantastic food. I would recommend a cruise to anyone mm. because it's just the best holiday. Yeah. You know, once you've cruised, yeah. you'll never go back. Hey. <laughs> have you ever been back on the cruise ship since you... Yes. Yeah? yeah, me and my mum get on quite... A, well, when Henrik gives me some time off, that is. Yeah. You know, we, we nip off and, and have a week here and there. So, yeah, yeah I still go on the cruise ship because it's fantastic. Lovely. Lovely talking to you. Oh, you. OK, help James right, out. James, I'll come back and see you. you. OK, five minutes or less, in fact, Brian. Five oh, minutes. Oh, thanks.
That's looking good, right? So we got the kofta on cooking. Yeah. Are you in? Have you got it in? I've got that here, yeah. Right now, let's going to see how good you are at this now. Oh no, don't make me pipe. Now come on, you can do it. Just for posterity. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Squeeze it like that. Twist it like that. And then all I want you to do is this. Look. Oh, let's have a look. Oh. I'm going to cover it up a minute, so you'll be fine. A lot. Just a nice little bit in the middle. No, hold it like that if you can. Oh, like what? Like that. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's it. And squeeze it right. Just let everybody see what you're doing. Yeah. There you go. Yay! Look at that. Fantastic. <laughs> what about cruising for you? Do you go going out there on cruise no, ships? Do you like that? Yeah, I've been on a couple of cruises rather late in my life. I've done about four now. Uh -huh. And of course, the uh, in October, I took a whole bunch of friends on a cruise for a week for my 60th birthday. So oh. it was phenomenal, even though we mm. had some bad weather. Mm. And one day when no one came up for breakfast, but everything yeah. else did. <laughs> <laughs> Now, when you, re when you released the song The Bachelor Boy, yeah. did you still expect to be a bachelor 30 years later? No. I mean, all of us, when we were in our 18s, 19s, 20s, all the shadows mm. got married. I thought it was inevitable that I would. Yeah. But in a way, I'm glad I didn't. You know, uh, I still think that if you're going to have a relationship, then you need to commit yourself to it. Yeah. And at the moment, I think I quite like cruising. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, well, why not? <laughs> Do you want to have a little thing? Because Brian and uh, Jane's over there were yeah. practicing this kind of shadows routine. Do you want to see that, ladies and gentlemen? Oh, Yay! Yes, you darling. Here we go. Come on down here, Cliff. Bachelor boy. Just a little bit of bachelor boy. Okay. They've got the... Oh, don't worry. Here we go. Put the right. Son, you are a bachelor boy. And that's the way to stay. Happy to be a bachelor boy until your dying day. Yay! <laughs> 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 oh, lovely, yeah, that? Yeah, Fantastic. Yeah. Okay, Miss let's see, ladies and gentlemen. Now, do you mm. like your meat underdone or underdone? Mm. I like it underdone. Good. It better be underdone, wouldn't it, eh? That's no, that's it. lovely. We've got it sorted now. Nice. And Cliff, have, have you ever been uh, like it, oh, you there? Have you ever been there? Oh, that's brilliant. It's just wonderful. It is. I'm not quite sure why they've got us on here, to be honest. No, I have no idea. Absolutely. Mm. I don't think it's supposed to agree with us. <laughs> you like James? Well, mm. uh, two minutes to go, boys. Good two line. minutes to go. Who counts? Yeah, who counts? Mm. Would do you, you, like know, a, do you know? Do you know this, a similar song together? Twelfth um, of Never. You must know oh, that yes. one. Uh, you want to start? You ask how much I love you. Must I explain? I need you, oh my darling, like roses need the rain. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's starstruck. <laughs> oh, I didn't oh, want to join in. I thought I couldn't remember the rest of the lyrics, but, I, but I've been off for you. <laughs> OK, Perfect. the music's coming up. OK, oh, the music's coming up. Oh, Any my second. goodness. Oh, you had a chance right there, didn't you, darling? You had a chance. On your next oh. album, on my next album, Cliff, we should get together and do a duet. What we do you should. think? Yeah, yeah. yeah. right, yeah. definitely. Ooh. What do you hey, think? Something's happening here. Something's happening. <laughs> there goes the music. <laughs> One minute. Oh, blimey. Sorry. Right. Can James and I be the backing group? OK, yeah. then. Yeah, you could have been the backing group. Some, uh, now, this is all happening here. James is cooking off the calamari. Yeah. Right. Take Remember what? what they're voting for, the ladies out. and gentlemen, the what the out. chefs did with the ingredients they were given. Oh, look at this. It's really coming along. Have you ever been starstruck? Is there anybody out there you look at you like that? Almost everybody that's number one. Really? Yeah, you can't help it because it's really difficult to do that these days. Mm. So anybody that actually makes it, you have to go mm. wonderful. Right. 30 seconds to go. Less than, boys. So Sorry. Nice right. and fork. Okay, then. Knife and fork. Spoon 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 under there. The there we are. Ow, Tot. Ow, ow. Let me take this out of the way. 20 seconds. Spoons, yeah. <laughs> 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Two, one, stop cooking! Yeah. Yeah. That's a Get out of there. Oh, wonderful. Yeah. 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 Well, I've got to say, ladies and gentlemen, it's amazing what these chefs can do in 20 minutes, but let's find out how it tastes. Now, Cliff, yeah. get stuck in there. What oh, are you going to call yeah. this, Brian? Let's start here, go that way and finish there okay. with the last I'm bit. I'm going to okay. make a mess of it, but who well, cares? Well, yeah. because Cliff was so good, wasn't he great? Yeah. Because Cliff was so good, I think it should be called. Congratulations, number one, you deserve a summer holiday, kid. Yeah!
<laughs> Milk it while she can. Well, <laughs> I shall tell you what, so Cliff brought along a lamb chop, sweet potato, red onion, baby spinach mm. and dolcelata cheese. What did you do with it, Brian? This is a spicy kofta, so it's the same chunk chop minced up mm -hmm. with onions, chilli, garlic, served on a turmeric and oh. uh, spinach bed with lots of soy it's sauce in the sauce. Yeah. I you can't eat it. No, I can't eat yet. All right. Fantastic. I get past oh, that's brilliant. Mm. <laughs> Says he modestly. <laughs> Lamb chop, just cooked there, marinated in soy sauce and sesame seed oil. Perfectly piped sweet potato puree. Mm. I mean, you could be doing cake decorations <laughs> next century. It's the wrist action, wouldn't it? Yeah. Uh, red wine sauce and then gorgonzola mm. on toast. Mm. Just melted with a honey dressing and a little vinaigrette in the spinach salad. What do you think? I'm, I'm just going to go down to the cellar for more wine. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it is fantastic. Thank you, sir. I mean, you're right, you said it. I don't know how these guys can cook out of nothing. Excuse me, can I do this? I've always wanted what? to do this. You've got a little man. <laughs> That's a good lad, now carry on. Well, I just don't know how they do it. It just seems impossible. They do it all the time. They I do know, it every I day, know. you see. I know. Yeah. Very good, isn't it? Thank you. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Yeah, well okay. done. Well done to you too, Brian. Now, over to you, James and Jane. Yeah. Your opportunity to get stuck into that. And looks luscious, doesn't it? Feast your eyes yeah, on this. Oh, I know. What are you going to call it? Um, well, I don't want any of those fancy names. You've been a Yorkshire lesson and all that. I'll say, you can prep my squid any time, doll. <laughs> <laughs> Well, Jane brought you along um, <laughs> oh. squid, rice, onion, sugar snap peas, a tin of sweet corn and a carrot. What did you do with it? Well, uh, we, oh, we attempted yeah. to do this sort of Indian batter, but mm -hmm. we carried on singing and my batter fell off. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, you've yeah. got chips and scraps, you know, <laughs> right? like fish and scraps. Mm -hmm. um, scraps but we tried to do sort of this Indian batter. Um, we made a sort of tomato chutney, which has gone in there with our sweet corn. A nice rice, which finished with loads and loads of spices, Indian spices and honey. Uh, lots of coriander, some mint went in there and flat leaf parsley. A little bit of reduced balsamic vinegar, basil oil, that one. Mm. And then a lovely sort of salad, sort of a Thai salad with orange, uh, the blanched carrot strips. Oh, um, it smells coming out of there, yeah. isn't it? Wonderful. Fabulous. And then that's just literally marinated in soy sauce, sesame oil, honey mm. and coriander. And just literally salt and pepper. And and Just on a chart, on a griddle pan. What do you oh, think, Jane? It's orgasmic, is that gorgeous? Is it really good? <laughs> oh, well, she thinks it's orgasmic, Jane. Oh, <laughs> but it really is good. What do our audience mm. think, ladies and gentlemen? Is it going to be James's red tomato or Brian's green pepper? Let's find out. Will you all please vote now? Well, there they go. Oh. And guess what? It's a green pepper day! <laughs> <laughs> Well done, by the way. There's a thousand pounds to award your favourite charity, which is? Which is the Roy Castle uh, Cancer Research Foundation. <laughs> Brilliant. Thank you so much for coming on. Really, great. Lovely, thank lovely you. to see you. Thank and you. And thanks to you too, Brian. Well done. That was lovely. Fabulous. I think you'd like a bit of that. I'm very nice favorite. indeed. Oh, sorry. Oh, oh, no, you're still eating. You're still enjoying it. Hey, mm. we're not going to send you home empty-handed. We've got a lovely celebrity <laughs> ready steady cook clock there for you. OK, that will look at... Can I have these? No, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. That will look a treat under the chandelier, <laughs> wouldn't it? Oh. Lovely. <laughs> All right, stop one. it. What's <laughs> like? Thanks for joining us. Until next time here on Ready, Steady, Cook. Have a lovely evening. Bye-bye. More stars next tonight on BBC One. This is your life. And Hollywood hits Luton. There's a new series of Homefront in a moment on BBC Two. To number one with 